Welcome back to another video. Today I'm just talking about the beauty of Pokemon. Whether you're 18 to 25, whether you're much older than that, we've all seen Ash do something in somewhat form. Whether that's seeing Pikachu in his Pokeball, whether it's playing Pokemon Go. You know, the beauty of Pokemon is that it brings so many people together. And now that we're older and we saw Ash become champion a couple of years back, maybe like two to three years back, it touched our heart seeing one of our childhood it's crazy it was one of our childhood heroes in terms of what pokemon was for us seeing him be eventually become champion for me i'm saying he was robbed in xy he should have be a line and that should have just been it for the show for sure i don't know why he got tried in sun and moon for that but that's my personal gripe. anyway but as we see and we adventure throughout the ways of pokemon and it has great rewatch value uh eventually grow and see the worlds of pokemon play the pokemon games trade with our friends our pokemon battle it out with against our our friends with our pokemon you know the golden age before you had to pay for a nintendo online to beat your friend in a pokemon game it was it was so beautiful that many people that you didn't expect to play pokemon played pokemon because they saw it on television we woke up saturday morning at least for me it was on channel 32 we woke up saturday morning saw pokemon saw beyblade uh, many of y'all saw bakugan i caught bakugan on the later end so it really wasn't there for me uh watch the shows grow with ash watch the movies whether that was garatina a fire movie whether that's manaphy pokemon ranger whether that's uh, pokemon 2000 mewtwo or mewtwo and genesec or the lucario movie as we expanded and saw more world of pokemon in terms of that also on the lucario movie though i will probably make a movie review for it later it is wild to that to think that there was a pokemon war i know non-canon but still <laughs> as we grow with the po as we grew with ash and saw more of this pokemon world to more and more and more and we played the games on the ds before they kind of just threw it in the trash in the switch sort of <laughs> right more and more we got to grow and love Pikachu, grow and love the different versions of Ash Team. The people that we saw Pokemon that we never wanted to leave his side. Greninja shouldn't have left his side. Charizard should have left his side, but it still hurt. Torterra, Chim, you know, we got Chimchar's story, tragic. Uh, Infernape, you know, all these battles we got to see within Paul, Barry, uh, the more Pokemon matches the more pokemon uh badges gem battles and i'm missing one it wasn't called gem battles i'm not remembering what it was because it was a specific show where he could have pokemon frontier where he could have been a frontier brain so technically he can be a frontier brain i like to think that's what he's doing now in the new show since they removed him as a main character i just like to think that's what he's doing he's just a frontier brain chilling honestly they was cool i like pokemon frontier and then the fire theme songs in back of it if i sing uh p-o-k-e-m-o-n po pokemon generations even the underrated gems now pokemon for a lot of people was their childhood it was my childhood too along with many others but it, it was many people's childhood as you would come to school with your DS, 3DS. You would come to, you would go away with your DS, 3DS, with your family, your friends. Anytime you look back on Pokemon, Beyblade, just reminds, just reminds us as a better time, a simpler time in our lives where we could say, "Hey, that's what I was doing. I was chilling," and we took it for granted then. Whether it's because someone said it wasn't cool or someone said it wasn't, wasn't right to do it you know judgy people when they was younger but now when you older it was like man i should have done more of that you take it for granted and you see how f fast time flies like we would never think ash became champion and that's that's the beauty of it 
And I did do this video a couple of years back, if you're in terms of this, and you've been subscribed to me a long time. I don't know who, how many people seen this video, seen that video, but I just wanted to redo it. But, but yeah, think Ash Ketchum. I, it was two years back. Becoming champion brought so many people back that dropped Pokemon just because you got older, just because just because life happens right brought so many people back for him being champion to celebrate his win it was worldwide news at least in the pokemon community the anime community the cartoon community to see ash who should be 36 in the show but he don't age a day past 12 get his championship it's like if derrick rose became a champion no, no matter how he did it no matter what series he did it no matter when we stopped watching it was major to us to see him win right and then you gotta think it it made a lot it makes pokemon it's still very popular it's still very much one of the top selling top popular anime slash cartoon shows that are that are out within the pokemon cards pokemon games it's still very much popular within the adult space because we're all grown now and within the children's space as we expose people to pokemon itself right pikachu timeless ash timeless brock timeless misty timeless tracy forget him right <laughs> i'm thinking about claremont but not many people remember claremont but iris because she was in the game so was claremont but iris was champion iris timeless for real especially if you really like uh, pokemon black and white too i i appreciate them i'm not i appreciate the game now in terms of that in terms of that we got it and then this is my closing point before we get to the end of pokemon as many of us still have stopped watching stuff many are active with the pokemon pokemon go when it first came out oh Team Valor, Team Electric, you know, Team Vados was genuine peak within app community. Everyone downloaded it. You were seeing people, you were seeing news headlines, people jumping off hills to get this shiny, just people jumping off this to get the Poke Spots. Poke Spots being in the most dangerous places in the community. Poke Spots being off this hill. You were going into reservoirs because you needed this Pokemon. You wanted to be part of this event. Red. absolute mayhem within pokemon for it to be as big as it was and that is the beauty of it that it's so big now no one shamed you if you watch this pokemon but back then if you watched pokemon if you watched beyblade if you watched any of those animated cartoon shows you were seen as weird sort of which is weird because we all watched it but then people called us weird for that but now it's not weird and it's real cool and real nice to see that Pokemon was part of the curve to change that. Anyway, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.